What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another video. It's me. They call me Heat. And I am a music producer of over 10 years and on this channel right here, I teach producers and help producers create the best boom bap beats. So there's always like this, this big thing about trap, boom bap, you know, what sounds like, what is trap, what is boom bap, you know, it's been a few so many times in so many different ways, but I guess people get caught up in, you know, people say I need boom bap drums, I need, you know, boom bap samples, I need boom bap whatever. But to me, it's not that you need that. I think that you can create beats with any type of sample or loop that you may have or drums that you may have, as long as you know how to tweak it and make it sound good and make it sound like you. Shout out to Internet Money, first of all. One of their producers named Cody, he released his sample packs um, a while back. So I grabbed them all up and I was like, yo, it would be dope to see if I could go through these packs and possibly find a sample or a loop in here coming from a trap producer and try to make like a boom bap beat with a trap loop so that's what i'm gonna be doing today i'm gonna find or go through these trap style loops and see if i can cook up you know something boom bap something grimy maybe jazzy smooth just see what comes out of you know whatever i find here let's go ahead and get into it if this is your first time watching make sure you subscribe make sure you hit the notification bell turn on all notifications just so you don't miss any more videos all right in the future and yeah let's get into it let's see if a boom bap producer can take trap loops and make something great all right so yeah i hope this inspires you guys to go create that boom bap all right let's get into the video yeah let's go So I'm gonna go into my trap kits. They're all right here. These are loop kits. Just pretty much all loop kits right here. You can make something with that. That could be like something like Kanye would mess. I mean, not Kanye, but Conway would would rock with something like that if it was chopped up. I think I could mess with that too. I didn't expect those type of sounds and samples to be in here. That's kind of, that's crazy. I didn't, like, I'm, <laughs> I'm expecting, like, some hard, like, trappy kind of loops. Wrong, 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 wrong. I like that. I like that. I like the tone of where it's at. Let me see what I can do with it. Of course, you know we got to put it in the fruity slicer here. You know, this is for quick jobs. Quick jobs, you know. Throw, usually throw it in. I could throw it in a Serato sample as well, but this is for quick job right here. So I got to get a good tempo now. I got to find a good tempo. It's got to be bouncy. It's got to be right. See, I know I always got I always got drums in my head. I always have drums in my head, so this is gonna be good. This is this is dope. Let me start with my pull some old drums out. So you know, if you've been watching this channel, you know my drums. My drums have to hit. So I'm about to get these pumping really quick. I'm gonna build up a quick pattern and then try to build the sample around the drums that I'm laying down here. I got my, I got like a kick and a snare. 
heavy, heavy kick. Watch when I fix that snare up. So I'm gonna pitch the snare up, like I'm gonna go up a couple of semitones. Cause that's the normal tone. I want it to hit like a like a real snare. That's that I like that. So I gotta put some effects on that sample now to see what I can do. Of course we gotta put some hi-hats in there. I'm gonna put like that dirty one in there. I may find some like real ones in addictive drums and resample them and take them down to put a RC20 on it to give it that dirty effect. But let me lay this one down for you. Drums are sounding good so far, so now I gotta go mess with the sample and lay that down and see what you know what we come up with. <laughs> the pitch let me uh, take it up just a little bit <laughs> gotta get the bass line right I gotta get this bass line Gotta get this bass line right. Bass line is about to be crazy because this is so amazing. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. Like, I took a trap loop from a trap producer and I made a boom bap, like a hard boom bad beat here this is dope so I'm gonna lay this bass line that I have <laughs> there was one note <clears throat> where I hit double I was like not supposed to go all right so <clears throat> you guys know I'm, I'm about to go find some arcade some stuff an arcade and see like what I can do in there it's gotta be some piano riffs or something in there that I can use so that's what I'm about to go find right now
just sounds good and I just want to put it in at like right on the one um, I don't know it just sounds good as like an accent background piano stat sound That was it. That was it. That was it. That was the one. I had to go through like many different ones to find it, but that I, I found it. All right. So there is one plug in, you know, because this is kind of giving me like West Coast vibes. Although it is like more, it is a boom bap style beat because of the way that you know the drums are, but it's giving me like boom. Uh, it's giving me West Coast vibes. So I'm gonna go find this plug in that I have called Lush 101. It's very West Coast synth heavy type of plug in just kind of see what I can build up, you know, with that. sound simple like simple just back and forth just uh something like that just keep it you know simple in the background watch this <laughs> all right so i got this stab that i want to put in right there but i found the key of where it needs to be when I throw it in. Watch this. All right, so I got the stab in there. Now the stab sounds really good. So now I think a crash and an open hat would be um, perfect to like just kind of set everything off from here. open hat in now that I figured out what I want to which one I want to use now Now here's the last thing that I'm gonna put in in this beat. So for right now, <clears throat> I'm gonna just put this last, this like this crash in there, just simple, simple crash, nothing crazy. I'm just gonna throw that in there real quick, and then that I'm, I feel like that's pretty much the end of the beat that I'm gonna do today.
everybody that is the end of today's video thank you for tuning in and watching the video i appreciate you guys um yeah so that's just pretty much me just my everyday thing you know um i found some trap loops and i made a boom bap slash west coast kind of beat and it came out really dope i like it i really rock with it i mess with it and i hope you guys do too if you do make sure you give the video a thumbs up please just smash that thumbs up break it i don't know i don't know what you can do but smash that thing all right and yeah until next time i hope i inspired you guys to go create that boom bap okay uh as i said earlier make sure you subscribe if you have not turn on all notifications that way you don't miss any more videos after today all right and if you want the files of you know the sounds that i use in the beat from the sample to the drums um all of that yeah except the stuff that i use in vsts you can't get those sounds but all the wave files out of this beat making process will be um included if so if you're a patron make sure you go download this rewind the video and follow along use the sounds that i have provided for you and yeah i'm about to hear y'all and until next time peace